anybody can propose a code change. Uh, that, that could be just somebody as simple as a, com a consumer, a person that's not even involved in the electrical industry. Typically code changes are, are driven by about five different uh, uh, reasons. One of them is improved safety. One of them is new technology and so on. Uh, a lot of it is to do with improved safety, um, you know, and uh, a lot of new technology, of course, supports, uh, supports improved safety. Um, you know, the addition of, of requiring now car plugs in a parking lot uh, to be ground fault protected, that, that's obviously totally driven by safety. Um, you know, the corrosive uh, issue with, with barns, uh, that's obviously a safety issue and an infrastructure issue as well, because uh, there was a way up in the millions of dollars worth of, uh, worth of barn fires in Ontario in the space of a year or a little more. So, so, so that's to protect the infrastructure. Um, so, you know, there's a number of different reasons and, uh, uh, you know, technology continues to evolve. I've, I've been very lucky. I've been involved in a couple of the sections uh, and, and very much hands-on uh, with, with some of those changes and either supporting them or uh, revising the proposal that comes in and then making it easier to understand and then it gets adopted or whatever the case may be.